Last thing I'm going to show you is whichever way you go, your objective is to get to the top. So what I'm going to show you is a simple option, and I'm going to show you a little bit more of an advanced option. Still off the squid. The squid, you have squid guard, you have lapel lasso, okay? So if I went okay, here, right? And then, so this is lapel lasso here, okay? Basically like an arm, right? So, center would be ringworm, left would be reverse the worm, and far left would be ring, uh, worm, right? So as we go here, and I fed it here, right? I pull the inverter okay? and then I sit up right here. See how far up I can get? And see how I'm pulling here? It makes it hard for him to tilt this way, okay? So I want to pull it even more. You got a little bit longer with help. So as I invert here, what I'm going to do, I'm going to sit up, and I'm going to just pull here to go around to the back. From here, my right hand, I'm going to pull this knee here, and I'm just going to come up right here, okay? However you come up, this way here is completely up to you. And it pulls that knee, and it's hard for him to face out, mm -hmm. and it's just a real simple sweep. <clears throat> This way, see that arm right there? So yeah, so if, it's, if you're here, yeah, I would just go here and that. And as I sit up, see right here? And just pulling this leg here, look. Just go right here. And then you just get to this point here, so here, and Okay, real simple, just watch your right foot so you don't kill yeah. <laughs> The next one that's a little bit more tricky is this. One, as I'm pushing him here, he's leaning back. But he's not overcommitted forward. He's not too committed back because that arm is back right there. Okay? All I want to do is invert over my right shoulder and just slide my knee through and get my right knee on the mat right here. And all I'm going to do is just pull him back in the same way as we did with other sweep, except I'm just controlling this leg and I'm here. And if you notice, oftentimes the arm winds up here, so Justin, so you can go here and begin to re at him this way here. If you block my leg here, again, I pull that arm out at the elbow, and I get here, and you have some more here. Yeah. <clears throat> this is a fun one, except you have to have the toes pointing in. Yeah. One, two, three. If I do this, and I, I see his toes pointed out, like I wouldn't sweep him. Because I know I'd probably end up with it in Because oftentimes, you pull him that way. If he rolls off that way, his foot stuck, his knee's gonna go, okay? You gotta be very aware. So when you do this, you gotta make sure the feet are tucked there. Yeah, because you wanna pull this knee. So as I go here, I wanna go here, and shove my legs through here, as I push him, back with my right knee and I pull him with my right hand because his left leg can't go back because I want to get my right knee onto the mat and even get here and then I'm going to plot a set here and now from here I can begin to replot it in here I can go here for a triangle here he'll stop the triangle maybe pull the arm in I go here he'll pull that elbow out and then you go right back and I'm going to plot it here he'll pull that arm out here, grab, right here. I'm gonna lean him all the way back, right here, and over right here. And then just lock him up, right there. All right, try that. You have two options. First option, then you shoot it. Same concept, look. You're here, you go up, and then you go. You see how you already tilt? Put the foot right here, and just drive up. And just step over. Real simple. 
It could work. If they push back into you, you can reinvert. It's just a matter of what you do with it, how creative you get to it. But the whole key is to this balance, okay? Let's go, one, two, three. Let's go.